Thunder Bay's recovery from the COVID-19 pandemic will get a significant boost this year from cruise ship traffic. A pair of large passenger carrying vessels will stop at the Pool 6 dock this year, the first cruise ships to visit the city since 2012. Corey Nordstrom has more. After 10 years away, Thunder Bay's shore will finally see visitors from cruise ships this year. Viking will be turning around their brand new Viking Ocantis, uh, luxury cruise ship here in Thunder Bay seven times. We also have two day stops planned with another company and their ship is the, uh, the Ocean Navigator. Thunder Bay's tourism manager says despite the relatively small number of visitors in the grand scheme of things, the return of cruise ships is huge for the city coming out of the pandemic and going forward. The impact is so large that the CEDC provided $100,000 last year to improve the Pool 6 dock in anticipation of the ships, while applying for $1.3 million in funding to cover the work. Pepe expects it to take years for the economy to truly rebound from the pandemic, but attracting new people gives the city an added PR boost. It really helps us tell Thunder Bay's stories to a, a new audience, an affluent international audience, that are interested in things like the indigenous tourism, indigenous culture. Uh, they're interested in culinary, they're interested in history, uh, they're interested in the natural attractions and the geology of the area. And those are all things that we do quite well here. So uh, that's going to really help us grow that segment of that industry. And in order to entice their customers to set sail, some of Thunder Bay's top attractions will be headlined in advertisements for the two cruise ships. These companies really elevate our profile uh, on a global level, at an international level. The reach, the media and PR reach that it, it gives us is, uh, is worth millions of dollars in terms of the, the earned media value. So that's something that we're looking forward to. It's, you know, it's a sign of we're moving in the right direction for recovery. Corey Nordstrom, TVT News.